Namaste friends. In this video, we are going to see model portfolio 8 for the module 8 Pedagogy of Environmental Studies. Before going to see this model portfolio activity, if you are watching our channel first time, if you are not subscribed our channel still now, please don't forget to subscribe our channel and click on bell icon and select all and like please don't forget to like our video like and share and and tell your opinion in a comment box okay now let us move to our portfolio let us see what is given in portfolio activity select a chapter or unit from evs textbook of any class and design a lesson or unit plan with the activities where children are actively involved in the learning process here steps, some, are, some of the steps are given to complete the activity. Describe the chapter or unit in terms of key concepts. That means you have to write the key concepts of selected unit. Describe the context including the school and facilities, children and their needs. Write learning objects for each lesson. You have to write the learning objectives of the selected unit and design a lesson or unit plan aligned with the learning objectives. Enlist the resources needed for the learning opportunities. You have to enlight the resources. What are the resources are there for the needed for the learning opportunities? Detail out of, detail out the activities, both individual and group activities, and arrange them in sequence. Check and integrate various concerns. That means gender, art, inclusion as aspects wherever possible. Plan and design assignment form is needed. Map the lesson with the learning outcomes that can be achieved. Use the template given to complete the task. Okay, we have to use this uh, following uh, template is given to complete the, uh, to design a chapter or a unit plan of uh, EVS. First, we have to select the topic and select the class and select the class size, the number of students in a class. Lesson description. You have to write the key co key concepts, key points you have to write. Learning objectives, resources or technology, learning experiences, design and intended, intended learning outcomes. That means learning outcomes and learning objectives both are you have to write and resources and learning experiences means learning strategies, strategies for teaching learning process. Already we know the resources and strategies from the module 8. So these are the strategies and resources. Strategies means these are the projects, discussion, experiments, explorations, surveys, interactions, interviews, role play, field visits, drawing and craft work. That means in this portfolio we have to select the unit and we have to select the uh, activities. We have to choose the activities in that unit with these uh, strategies. By applying these strategies we have to select the activities from this selected unit. Next these are the resources, textbooks, supplementary material, books and e-resources, e audio, video, pictures, media, environment. Okay, these are the strategies and resources already we know from the module 8. So now let us move to our model portfolio. So this is the model portfolio, what I wrote. Let us see what, let us see how I wrote and what I wrote in a portfolio. Module 8, Pedagogy of Environmental Studies, Portfolio Activity. First, you have to write here basic details of the teacher, name of the teacher, name of the school, treasury ID, U days, like that. You can write more basic details of yours. Next topic, I selected the topic plants around us, class 4, class size 30, lesson description. Here we have to write the key concepts of the lesson, what you selected. Plants, trees are, plants are trees or three types, herbs, shrubs and trees. Generally, plants have roots, stem, leaves, flowers, and fruits. Roots grow below the ground. Plants absorb water and nutrients through the roots. We obtain necessary fruits and vegetables from the plants. These plants grow, grow from seeds. Seed is obtained from flower. 
Some people depend upon flowers to earn their livelihood. Seeds germinate into new plants. The size of a tree does not correspond to the size of the seed. Seeds are small and some are big in size. Air, water and sunlight are essential for the germination of seed. A, nurse, a nursery is a place where a wide variety of plants are grown. Now let us see learning objectives. As per EVS curriculum, children are expected to acquire awareness about immediate wider surroundings environment through lived experiences on various themes related to daily life, nature, natural curiosity and creativity for the immediate surroundings, develop sensitivity for the natural, physical and human resources in the immediate environment. Next, let us see learning outcomes. Learning outcomes means the abilities which we are expected to bring up uh, from the children by in this unit. Children will be able to know the different types of plants, understand the parts of the plants, know about the roots, stem, leaves, flowers and fruits, know which fruits or vegetables have seeds inside them which does not have seeds inside them, know about the nurseries. Now let us see resources. What are the resources we can use uh, for this unit? Plants or leaves, fruits, flowers, vegetables available in the surroundings or in their home or uh, near the school like that. Charts and experiences of the children. Now let us see here strategies for the teaching learning process. Already as earlier we, uh, we saw that uh, some of the strategies by using those strategies we have to select the uh, activities from the selected unit and you have to write the those activities. First one, field observations. See the picture given below. The children observe the, this picture and uh, likewise uh, observe the plants, uh, trees uh, which you see in your surroundings. And are they all alike? What differences did you observe? Which plants are creepers? Which plants are bushy? Which plants are growing densely? Write two or three examples for each in the table given below. Climbers, shrubs and trees. Now come to second strategy projects. Observe the in the project uh, let us see what the activity active. Observe the plant given below. Observe and collect a flowering plant from your surroundings. Compare this plant with the plant given in the picture. Does your plant have the same parts as the as the one given in the picture? Is every part similar to this plant? Discuss about the parts of a plant with your friends. Next third one, drawing pictures. Collect the roots of a paddy, jar, capsicum and cotton. Observe them and draw diagrams. Here they have to draw here roots of a paddy, roots of jar, roots of capsicum, roots of cotton. Now come to fourth one, discussion. Look at the picture given below and discuss in groups. This is a picture by observe this picture they have to discuss in groups. What vegetables and fruits are there in above picture? From where do we get fruits and vegetables? From where do we get the plants? Do all the plants grow from seeds? From where do we get the seeds? Next come to fifth one. Interaction or interview. Find the answers from a florist in the following aspects. May I, know, may I know your name? Since when have you been doing this business? Which flowers do you sell? How much do you earn by this? When do you earn more? Which flowers are more profitable? Are all the flowers sold by you available locally? Do you bring flowers from other areas and sell? How do you preserve such flowers? Do any of your family members help you in the business? Like this. Next. <coughs> Role play. Ask the children to act as a talking tree. It tells about the uses of a tree. We have to ask the children to act as a uh, tree and they have to say the uses of the uh, tree. Like this, I will give uh, I will give the tree, um, plan, I will give the uh, fruits, uh, flowers, like that. I will give the wood, like that. Uh, they have to, uh, all the uses of the trees, the, ask the children to tell, like act as a talking tree. 
this is the role play in this role play that uh, art art integration we have to integrate the art in this lesson also already in that uh, activity asked the art integrate the art and uh, uh, integrate the inclusive art integrated inclusive classroom and gender integrated that means while we are forming a groups uh, uh, we have to form the groups boys and girls as a one group like that uh, and also uh, art also integrated role play and diagrams like that okay next uh, come to sharing experiences look at the picture from form groups discuss and share your experiences with your friends which fruits have seeds inside them why do the seeds of all fruits resemble each other do all the fruits have the same number of seeds name the fruits and vegetables which have only one seed name the fruits and vegetables which have many seeds name the seedless without seed fruits and vegetables these are the uh, sharing experiences in their uh, with the friends they have to share their experiences by asking these questions next one last one experiments and explorations farm groups put 10 green gram seeds in a tin box filled with uh, filled completely with water other 10 green gram seeds in a tin box containing a wet cloth and another 10 green gram seeds in an empty tin box observe for two days write write two obs write your observation in the table given below and each group can repeat this repeat with the bengal gram and uh, leguminous seeds this is the uh, table box one box two box three they have to uh, write their uh, observations in these uh, boxes availability of a to the seed which should have the availability of a they have to write tick tick mark put the tick mark which box the seed in which box has the availability of a did you water these seeds and change observe germination of the seed okay that means the seeds in which the which of the boxes germinated they have to put the right mark the seeds in which of the boxes is germinated box one or box two or box three what differences did you observe in the bo box containing germinating seeds and other boxes okay this is the last eighth one uh, experiments and uh, explorers this is strategy this is the portfolio what i wrote now for the module 8 pedagogy of uh, environment environmental studies thank you